Okay, to remove the clutch master cylinder from the clutch pedal assembly, I'm going to show you outside of the truck so you can actually see what's going on. But one of the first steps is you would rotate the clutch master cylinder. It's like it would have been clockwise, uh, 45 degrees. And pull that out just to get it started. And then there's two tabs on the uh, rod here. You pinch those in and pull it out like so. I'm going to put some grease on the end of that ball. Uh, the truck had a little bit of a squeaking noise when he was pushing the clutch pedal. I'd like to try to eliminate that if possible. All right, I found me just some plain old wheel bearing grease. Nothing special about it. And I'm going to put this on the end. I don't know, it, it may not work, it may not stick around, but... What could it hurt other than it dripping down on your foot? Or your wife's foot. If it's on my foot, it's not bad, but if it's on her foot, I'll take a beating. Now you gotta hold your tongue right. Now I've almost got it put in place, but I'm going to get it lined up with the clutch pedal first. You can see it or not. I finally got it pushed into the hole. And that's supposed to be st strapped down, so I've got it pushed into the square, and now all you have to do is rotate it. Looks like it's quite in there yet. <sighs> or maybe it is. If I press too hard, I'm gonna break it off. Looks like it's sealed up there pretty good, sitting against the clutch pedal assembly like it's supposed to. It's pretty close to straight up and down. Now, the real test is whether or not I've got a uh, clutch pedal here. Yes. Now all my grease wiped off the end of that uh, before I got it back together to hear how See how noisy that thing is? Well, that's annoying. I think that's worse than my old one. So, I'm going to try to fix that. All I'm going to do is take a little bit of grease and put it on that white ball again. Try to get that thing quiet down just a little bit. Still noisy. Now I'm assuming that the rest of that noise is coming from up here, but I don't know that for sure. The only other place would be from the other side of that ball. There's a metal rod that goes in the back side of that ball, and then the ball rides on the clutch pedal. So I'm figuring a lot of this out as I go along with you reach up there and start prying these tabs out and pulling it off at the same time you can pull this off the end of the clutch rod. So now I'm going to put grease in the bottom of that hole. See if that takes care of it. Now don't forget to plug in your wiring, but listen to that. I think we've got it now. Let's go. Thanks for watching.